Twinkling Beetles. I'm gonna use these gas arrows to try to take them down with this beefy guy who I just pumped up. My goal is to do a lot of damage to him and then hope that the poison gas kills him as a result. So we'll see. Also, you'll notice down there, I got my friend Natsume on, who's currently technically paused out using the bathroom, but uh, I've explained the rules to her. Can't use any of my stuff except for the zip lines. So we'll see how long it takes her to, uh, you know, get set up and get going. In the meantime, I want to go test this arrow nonsense out. Oh, oh, you know what else? We should make the, uh, we should get the 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 the, 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 the zip line set up. Let's do that. Let's get the zip line and connect. And we're gonna go ahead and <laughs> 47 string. Jesus. Okay, but there we go. We are connected to the other side of the uh, the shed. Uh, we got Princess Natsume down there doing something. What are you doing, Natsume? I'm cooking at the moment. Cooking at the moment. <laughs> yeah. I'm We're gonna... not going to start getting any more materials until the sink comes back up because loud noises are startling and you can't see them. Oh, the loud noises are the worst in this game. So. Basically, we're just waiting for Natsume to hurry up and get her stuff together so we can, go, we can fight termites eventually. Maybe not in this episode, but <laughs> eventually. I just killed, I just killed a black ox beetle with gas arrows because I want to kill the twinkling dudes, but I came across a stuck one and then he wasn't stuck and I almost died. But I do got enough materials now. I can craft the black ox hammer and craft. we have a black ox hammer. Sweet. Okay. Well, then let's uh let's do some achievement hunting because that's what I really want to do. I want to get all the achievements. Okay. So in the middle of this uh, achievement hunting and mutation hunting, I really want to check out this spider area here, and I feel strong enough because I fought the spider before. And this is not the way over there. <laughs> Gotta go around. Okay. Here's here's where it gets scary. There's little spiders around everywhere. There's the big spider. Okay. There's the raw science I want, but I don't want to just... I've hopped in like an idiot! I've hopped in like an idiot! Oh no. Okay. We're good. Get the spider web. We're just gonna collect a bunch of stuff. <laughs> okay, what's down here? I wonder if this is like the proper way in. Oh, I can't see over my... I can't see over my big head. <gasps> ooh! 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 Okay. This is... <laughs> no! No! <laughs> no! We're fine. We're f no! <laughs> no! <laughs> Let's switch real fast. It's fine. It's not fine. Okay, we're fine. It's just an orb weaver. I gotta clear out some of these webs. I've never been down here before. <sighs> I see you, orb weaver. Says I'm right on top of a scab too. Where's the scab at? I want to get you, Orb Weaver, but you're making it look scary over there. Yeah, come at me! Yeah, I got you. Now there's a million tiny little spiders. Not to me! I can't help you. I'm sorry. I'm also I, being swarmed by a bunch of little mites, and I wish when they're you were in stronger. an army, they take you out quick. Okay, no, we're fine. This is easy. I see I'm surrounded by spider webs. What the heck? Oh my god, is this a skeleton? What? Like a person's? Like a big skeleton. Like a human oh. skeleton, but it's- Oh my god, it's a giant skeleton! Alright, dad's up to some weird stuff in his meantime. This is a giant humanoid skeleton underground here. There's somebody buried in the backyard. There's somebody buried in the backyard. Ooh. Okay. That that opens a whole new layer to the lore of the game. And so it's either going to be... <laughs> Dad killed someone. And this is the body. Or... Or... You unshrink randomly, and this poor soul was stuck down here when they unshrunk. There's a huge lump of gum in there that I can't reach. Like I'm floating in the air above the rib cage because there's like a giant hitbox around it. There it is. I found it. Syndrome. 
All right, let's see what Syndrome looks like. Change it from my favorite cyber strike down to Syndrome. Oh, that's pretty. Not so many. Check out the Syndrome one in the OS. That's pretty. I might be. I I might use that. I'm gonna rock that for a little bit. It's like a metallic like and that. blue. Yeah. I like that. This is a giant spider's nest. After I clear up these webs, I'm gonna have to come back through it. Oh, there's the big spider. Whoa, big spider's coming down here after me. <laughs> Time to fight the big spider. I don't... Okay. Woo. I got hit. I got hit hard, but we're fine. <laughs> Cannot believe that there's human remains. I'm, I'm gonna be tripping about that for... The whole next couple minutes. Right? <laughs> At least. <laughs> That's what's under Rake Rock. Next clip. So I've been having a heck of a time here. <laughs> All my armor's broken. I went out to get more bug goop to repair my armor, and then the rest of my armor broke, and then I was only able to repair one piece. So it's going. It's going. But yeah, you know what would be pretty cool? I'm thinking we're going to set up. We're going to set up. A basketball hoop, which I have never made before, <laughs> and try to sink a shot from 40 centimeters. I think it says. Uh, let's see. Let's craft. Do I have a quick craft in here? Yes, I do. Okay, so I can set this up pretty much anywhere. I'm thinking we'll probably set it up over here, so I could take a shot off of off my house. <laughs> I think that might be the best way to try to try to get the 40, right? So let's go here. Sure. Does that seem like a good spot? Eh, yeah, seems fine. Now, here's the question. Where's the ball? Do I get a ball? How do I get a ball? Okay. So, Google says there is no basketball and instead... Uh, you just throw stuff in it and then sparks fly out. So, maybe building it there was a bad idea. That's fine, we can always relocate it. 40 centimeters. It's really hard to tell what that distance is, but... If I come over here... We're gonna try to dump one item in there, one of these rocks, and just see if we can get the spark thing to happen. Like it says it can. I missed. I missed again. I missed real bad. Man, I cannot get anything to go with. I did it! <laughs> Stars, okay. I'm the greatest uh, athlete in the yard, probably. All right, let's try to shoot from up here. Can't even, like, you could barely see it. Oh, that's a bad place for the leaves. You can barely see it right there, right? Whoop, there it is. So what happens if I go just aim high, right? Even aiming high, it's only going so far. Okay. So there's definitely a limit to how far I can throw. All right, so it's, now it's just a matter of a uh, trial and error. We gotta, we'll just move it. To roughly where I'm reaching. All right, there it is. So, right, we were like aiming like this or something. That's too shy. Oh, it looks so perfect too down there. I think we're too shy. It looks really good though. That look like our our trajectory is like straight on with it. It looked good. So we just need to relocate this to be just a little bit closer, but I don't want to get too close, right? Because we still really want to hit the 40 centimeter goal. Which I don't really don't know how far that is in this game. Like, there's nothing for like true comparison, right? Like, there's no measuring tape in here. Alright, so there we go. We're gonna line up. Just gonna move up. Throw. Too short. Throw. Too short. <gasps> we did it! I see the achievement! I know you guys can't see it, but there it is! Achievement unlocked! I just had to jump! I wasn't throwing it far enough. Heck yeah! For a moment there, I thought we were gonna have to like set up like a like a grass thing around it to like funnel the rock in. <laughs> Not today! Holy crap, what a vicious cycle! So, so, okay, it requires two bug goop and some various other parts, which I have. Those parts are easy. Two bug goop per roly-poly armor to repair. Right? Okay, so, I'm out here getting the bug goop, and then I die, my armor breaks, and then I die again, more armor's breaking, and then I die again, and then my armor breaks. 
Finally, I got enough bug goop to repair a single piece of armor. So I do. So that's what I'm doing right now. I got I got my one piece of armor on. And it needs to be repaired now. Um, but I finally did it. <laughs> I think I think I got five bug goop on me right now. Maybe six. But I know I definitely got one at the house. And yeah, I got five. So I got exactly enough. I got exactly enough bug goop to repair my armor. Again. <laughs> but no more reserves to repair after that. So... Basically, I, I need to start getting to like a, I need to get bug goop. Just get lots of bug goop. If you don't got bug goop, you're doing it wrong. You need the goop of a bug is what you need. I need lots of bug goop. This is ridiculous. <sighs> okay, there we go. Everything's all repaired up. I got it all back. I still have no bug goop. And I know what you're wondering. What happened to me taking care of the, uh, taking care of the dudes? The, the, the twinkling jewel beetle things. Well, I haven't found any. At all. <laughs> Not a single one. So that's where we're uh, where we are on that front. Uh, we're we're at the point of they don't seem to exist. So I guess I'll just have to keep an eye out for them. I guess because they're nowhere to be found. I did it. I figured out how to get into the mint container by the mysterious machine. <laughs> so <laughs> this stupid thing was was sealed and no matter how many times I hit it it was not opening but I started to, I got right up into the corner in case you're wondering if it's not opening for you too and uh I just kept moving my cursor slowly and slowly out until until finally the door just swung open but that's how I had to do it I, I basically just kept swinging kept swinging kept swinging until finally as I moved along this way it opened now I don't know if you can do that with the tier 2 uh, hammer, there's a chance you can. Uh, I was just under the impression you had to have a tier 3, but go ahead, give it a try if it's not opening for you. It's probably the weird angle, so... Yeah, there you go. Okay, so there's, a, there's a, one more achievement I can get right away. Uh, the other ones, Glob Job and the Mysterious One. Glob Job is, I gotta do the, the Termite Lair, and the Mysterious One I think is killing the Brood Mother, which I've never done since it's been updated, but... Something else I've never done that you might not believe is tame a pet. <laughs> That's what we're going to do right now. We're going to try to tame a pet. Let's put this in my main. My my tower of I'll put it in my strong Champion hand. The and then uh, now I just got to find an aphid because that's what I got as a plant slurry. So I got I got to find an aphid. Put one right there. Put one right here. <laughs> one of these is bound to work, right? <gasps> that one's eating one. You'll be my friend. Look how cute he is. Yeah, eat the other one. Eat the other one. Yeah. It's totally working. Come on. Come on. And. And he's freaking out. He ate two of them. Thought for sure I was going to have it. There goes one. Okay, that one's going to go for it. Yeah. Look at him. He's just chowing down like a champ. <gasps> he likes me. Yay, success. And pet. I did it! I am the owner of an aphid! I'm gonna pet you again. Yeah! I did not see the achievement come across my screen though. So... Does he have an inventory? Oh, the aphid has an inventory! They do? Yeah! I didn't know that. I guess... Can I... Or does he just pick up stuff? I don't know. Okay, now I got. I gotta make a house for him to come back to. Oh, that's cool when you turn around when he comes onto your screen. There's like a... A little icon above his head to let you know where he is and that he's yours. Oh, oh then you don't lose him so much. <laughs> look at this! Look! Look! Ready? Open. He's carrying my mushrooms! <laughs> the pets are extended storage. That's so cool. I'm afraid he's gonna die though. Like, <laughs> they're not very. I can punch him twice and he'll be dead. <laughs> and that's with my fist. Okay, so we got the house for the pet. Now we need. Craft pet goggles. Let me go put these on them. It's gonna look really cute. All right, so we're gonna click on this. There's the pet attire. Uh, equip. Close. Oh, oh wow. Oh, <laughs> yes. It's so fun look at, oh, uh, pff, slow down. Yeah, look at you. You're looking all cute and stuff. It's a bug wearing bugs. <laughs> it looks so serious. <laughs> yeah, it's Frank. Right there. Yeah, Mr. Frank doing a good job. I'm gonna go ahead and give you a- oh, no, come here, I'm trying to give you a pet. And pet. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and give- give Frank some pets. <laughs> and now, 
Now all that's left for the achievements is the glob job, which is maxing out a tool, which means I got to do the stupid beetles, which I've been trying to do. And I think killed the spider queen. I think, I think that's all that's left. So mutations, mutations, mutations. That's the name of the game now. That was it. I didn't even catch it on camera, guys. I'm so sorry. But the arrow, yeah, totally, the gas arrow totally just one shot this dude. Uh, I will say though that my crossbow is, uh, what is this, level 7. It's a mighty, mighty crossbow, so it's already a powerful one. But it totally one shots them. Oh, I got three twinkling shells from him! That's pretty sweet, okay. Let's see if I can find some more. I need like a hundred of these. Okay, so I was just thinking, you know, maybe, maybe there'd be some sparkling j you know, bug things up here or whatever. No, there's an entire world up here. I was not expecting. Oh, look, here's a termite. Let's test it. It's not spicy damage, right? Okay, that's spicy. This is salty. Okay. Hmm. It's hard to say. Look at all the spicy food up here. All right, well, I think I'm just gonna collect all this stuff and uh, keep looking for beetles. You know what? We have all of our armor repaired. We have uh, a new zip line going out. We have uh, all basically all the tools. Lots of things are really upgraded. Uh, quartzite's really the big one, right? Getting a ton of quartzite uh, bricks, globs, or whatever. And then we got to do the jeweled beetle thing a ton. So I actually think we're gonna end it here right now because there's a lot I want to do. Specifically, I want to build a secondary base there. And I think it's better to save that for the next episode. I think it's going to take Natsume a couple of more days to get totally geared up and ready, right? We're still running the experiment. I don't want to actually... I know I sound like a bad guy, but I don't want to help her too much. <laughs> Just the zip lines. That's the experiment. Just how far does a zip line actually help a new player? Uh, so I can't really interfere too much. Uh, so we're, we're just waiting on that. But I'm going to build a base tomorrow. I think it'd be really cool to have another base over there. But that's going to be it. Thank you for watching. Bye.